If you play Brookhaven, you've for sure been banned from a house because of a random player inside the game. It may sound kind of sad, but it does happen a lot. Don't worry, because in today's video, I'll be testing a bunch of viral TikToks that teach us ways to get unbanned from a house here in Brookhaven. First method we're gonna test is from this video. We start by him going to a player's house, when out of nowhere, he's just banned from it. Of course, he goes back to the house he was before. When he gets in front of it, he opens up the chat and writes unbanned. After that's done, he just crosses the barrier without a problem. What? That's why we're gonna test this one right now. It might even be true. First things first, we gotta get banned from someone's house. I'll get inside this girl's home, which for some reason is just fully open. Who even does that? Let's go straight to her safe so we can steal it. C4 in hand, we'll now have her money. Now let's run. This should be enough for her to want to ban us. There's two girls up front. Are they the owners of the place? If so, go ahead and ban me already. I have a video to do. They literally didn't even look at me. That's rude. Here I thought being banned was the easy part. Hey, could you just ban me please? Oh, she actually did it. Finally. With that done, we can finally test the guy's method out and see if it holds water. Here we are in front of her house. So let's go to the chat and write unbanned. It has been sent. Are we unbanned then? Nope, it isn't working. What if we try to write it with a slash? Slash unban. Even with that, it really doesn't seem to do anything. We're still blocked from it. So that TikTok was indeed a lie. There isn't a command you can do to just be unbanned like that. Now this TikTok is said to be the real way to get inside of a ban house in the game. First he grabs the shopping cart and whenever the guy is inside it he can just go in. We just can't stop holding the cart or we'll be thrown out again. I do have my worries about this method, but for a reason. This video was published in December of 2020. So we have to hope that this way of doing it wasn't patched in a later update. Already got banned by somebody else, which isn't really hard for me. With that done, let's get the shopping cart. There we go. Now we just need to put the player on the other side to try and get through the ban barrier. Dude, just get inside my cart, please. I really want to try this out. I'll just grab someone from outside. Maybe it just doesn't. Oh, it worked. We're in. Oh, she got out of the cart, so I was thrown out again. But it does look like it works. Let's grab another player and walk right in. That's really fun. I'll just get this guy. You're gonna be my specimen. Look at that. I got through the barrier. That's so cool. Good to know that this one actually works. I'll just have a stroll through this guy's house, hoping he doesn't ban the other guy. Oh, guess what exactly just happened? You can see how persistent I am. I had to be banned two times, but it's good to know that this method actually works. Another method he did was to get carried by another player that wasn't banned so he can get in. That's why I asked my bacon-haired friend to carry me on his back. He's a cool dude. All right, I'll just accept that. Dude, I'm actually inside again. This just doesn't make sense at all. Don't let Wolfpack see this. I don't want him patching this bug up. He even got the place with the bed. All right, what are we gonna do here? Wait, are we gonna be able to steal the safe of this place like this? He did take me to it, so let me get the C4. Now, is that going to work? You gotta be kidding me. I I actually got this guy saved. He wasn't fast enough. Look at the money in my hand. We did it before he could delete it. He did quit the game though. He couldn't take this level of trolling. Who knew you could do that without being unbanned? Now on this one, she shows us a way to have a house inside spawn. First, she comes to spawn and makes herself small. She then uses the crawl animation with the bag. Doing that, she can go through the ground. Look at that. She's now decorating the place, making it look real pretty. That's how she was able to make her herself a home below spawn. Of course, we're gonna test this one out. Here we are at spawn. First, what we gotta do is go into the ground. For that, we need to use the crawl animation. There we go. We're already crawling around. So let's go on our inventory and get the bag. With it in hand, we do the classic on and off hand. I'm trying as much as I can, but I don't seem to be able to do it. Oh, we forgot to shrink ourselves. Now it'll probably work. Let's get back to crawling and do the same thing as before. Look at that. We're beneath spawn. That's so cool. But to be honest, there's an easier way to get inside here. We actually just need to go to the downtown metro station. Here on this wall, we gotta click on the logo. After that, we'll be able to go right through this wall. That leads us back beneath the spawn. In a very easy way. Now let's just go and get the prop box. Because we'll have a bunch of items for us to decorate our new home. I'll start it off by getting an arcade machine. Since I'm a true gamer. As you all know. We'll 
We'll get a bed right here. We gotta sleep somehow. It's even red how I like it. Let me grab this little campfire grill. Just so we got a way to cook our food, of course. Then I'll just have some balloons just so it looks pretty. This actually looks really nice. I love this cozy little place we got going here. I'll get some food. Oh gosh, I'm on fire. What do I do? I don't know what to do. Someone help me, please. Oh, it's out. This video will show us a way for us to get free premium on Brookhaven. Please give it to me already. We start by looking for Brookhaven. All right, she got into the game. Good so far. We'll have to change our RP name to premium. She even made it cyan. Done. Now you're premium. I fully doubt any of that is true. But let's try and see. We're already in the game. So let's just go to our avatar editor. Here's where we choose our RP name. So let's write premium right there. Of course, we can't forget to paint it cyan. Apparently, we should have free premium after doing that. But how do I know that? There's no message nor anything saying that I have premium now. That's why I got into my second account since it doesn't have premium nor any of the game passes. Totally empty. We'll try it out right now on this one. Let's see if it does anything. I'll just go to a housing lot and choose one of the premium houses. This one, for example. Well, try as I might. I can't choose it at all. Where's my free premium? Above my name is still written premium, but that doesn't mean I have access to any of the things premium players have. So just as I thought, that was a fake TikTok. Don't be bamboozled, guys. Now this one's telling us a way to do a bug so we can hide in a house's floor. To start, he goes into someone's house. It has to be two stories. Now he does this lying down animation and shrinks himself down. After he refreshes his character, he just disappears. Whoa! He even grabs a gun to show how he is literally inside the floor. All right, we just need to find a house for us to test that out on. It needs to have two stories, so any of these two will work nicely. There are some people here, but I don't care. We're still gonna test it here. First things first, we gotta get in without them noticing us. I'll get small and grab the trusty bag. That's as big as me. With just these things, we can get into their house no problem. Well, I'm having a bit of a hard time, so let's try it right here. Okay, we're in. Here's the second floor. Oh, there's people here. I'll do the bug quickly before they can do anything about it. I actually disappeared. They couldn't get me in time. I can't believe this actually works. You can see where I am when I'm holding the bag at least. That's so weird. With this bug, we can just peep at people's homes without them noticing. They must be so confused about why the bag is here. Oh gosh, how did they even find me? Looks like this bug does work pretty well, but we still gotta be careful not to be banned by other players. Around the internet, there's tons of videos like these. Some of them teach you something new. Some of them just spread misinformation. So just be aware of that. But in any way, I'm gonna have to end the video here. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like on the video and comment down below what kind of stuff you want to see me do around Brookhaven next. Make sure to watch one of the videos on screen right now. They are never gonna ban you. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel for all kinds of Roblox just for you. Have a good one.